All right, so in previous videos, we've learned how to update our Minecraft client so that it's the proper version to connect to MC Magic. We've learned how to connect to MC Magic, and we've learned how to download and install the resource packs uh, so that we can see what everybody else sees when you're on MC Magic. But now, how do you get around? How do you experience the rides? How do you have fun? Uh, what's great is the staff over at MC Magic have made it really simple. So this is the area that you will start in the first time you connect to the server. Um, it's also slash spawn if you want to ever get back here. As you can see, there's a transportation and ticket center bus. And just simply walking on it and stepping on that pad warps you to the TTC. And this brings you to a board here that has all of the servers. Now, the way the, the server works now is that each part is broken up into its own independent server and the chat is shared between all of them. And the reason for this is so that lag is reduced by splitting up the maps and making them all a little bit smaller. They run a little bit more smoothly. The only uh, change is that you have to sort of manually connect to these servers before you could ride on any rides. So as you can see, there's an arcade that offers some like parkour and other Minecraft related games. There is a hub, which is where we are right now. There's MK, which is the Magic Kingdom. There's Epcot. There's Hollywood Studios, HWS. There's Animal Kingdom, which hopefully by the time this video is out is actually available. And then there is Creative, which is a creative server where people can build in Minecraft and sort of show off their builds with one another and grow a little community. So let's say we want to go to Epcot. How do we get to Epcot? Simple, you're gonna hit T to open your chat. You're gonna type slash join Epcot. And here we are, we are at Epcot. Uh, it brings you right to the beginning of the park where you can then start to explore. Now, if you're new to Minecraft and you see all this missing stuff, you don't have to worry about that. That's just a chunk. Sometimes it needs to be forced to generate. When you walk closer, it'll do it on its own or it'll just happen over time. Uh, so getting around the parks is quite simple. You can either walk around like this, which I find to be the most fun way and the most immersive way, or you can warp around if you like the appeal of magic. And to warp, it's very similar and very simple to the way we connect to the server. All I have to do is open up the chat and type slash warp and then enter the warp you want to go to. Uh, you can find a comprehensive list of all the warps on MC Magic's website, which is mcmagic.us. Um, a lot of the times you could just guess it. They're usually shortened versions of the ride's actual name. So let's go ahead and warp to the Italy Pavilion in Epcot. As you would imagine, it is warp. Italy and now we are here almost on the other side of the park in an instant in the blink of an eye and the chunks will start to load in and then we can walk around uh, some of them are a little more cryptic if you want to go to the universe of energy it's warp UOE not something you might have guessed right away usually if it's not the full name or a short version of the name it's the initials of the ride uh, so now we're at the rides. How do we actually ride the rides? Well, I'm going to show you and I'm going to do it by going to one of my favorite rides at Epcot and it's at Warp Norway. Going on the rides is extremely simple. Uh, you used to have to manually jump into the minecart trains to ride around. Uh, now it'll actually automatically pull you into the train so you don't have to worry about it. So once you walk through the queue, and once you enjoy the fact that this is one of the few times you'll ever be able to walk through a Disney queue with just nobody in it, uh, you're just gonna find a button. There's usually some sort of button that activates the ride. And you just have to press it once, and you do that by looking at it so that the crosshair is over the button and right-clicking. And there it is. This is one of the manual ones that don't pull you in, so you just look at the cart, right-click, and boom, I am now in, and we're riding the ride. So that's just a quick look at how you can get around the parks, connect to the parks, get around the parks, and then find rides uh, and ride them. So I hope this was helpful. In future videos, I'm gonna be covering all of the fun little goodies on the servers, such as autograph books, dolls, uh, how to use and get onto creative, and I'm going to explain what the ranks are and answer some other frequently asked questions when it comes to MC Magic. I hope you have a great week, and thanks for watching.